being called the most infectious and transmissible variant of COVID yet. BA5 is now the dominant variant in Wisconsin. Hospital cases up 10% over where we were last month. The hospital association says 427 people in the hospital today because of COVID 56 in the ICU. Katie Crow, they're joining us live right now in Shorewood with more on a new booster shot that is being developed to target specifically this and other new variants. Katie. Yeah, Steve, a lot of people stopping at pharmacies more and more right now to get tested. The most common symptoms of this BA5 variant are runny nose, headache, sore throat, persistent cough and fatigue. And really the main concern is this BA5 variant really appears to evade protection from vaccines or a previous COVID infection more than any other variant we've seen at this point. More people are getting COVID-19 even after being vaccinated and boosted. Developed a fever like 102 um, and exhaustion that I have never experienced. Talia Mendez is one of them. I have to wait three months before I can get the fourth boost. Strong believer in science. With each new variant, the battle to get control over COVID can feel more daunting. My thing is, well, when will it stop being on the rise? Oh, it keeps going up and down, up and down. You just want it to end. A new booster shot specifically targeting COVID-19 variants, BA4 and BA5, is on the way. Pfizer says it could be distributed by October. The FDA estimates that Omicron-specific boosters from Pfizer and Moderna will be available this fall. Is it even better than the booster we have right now is, is going to be a question. Dr. Dan Shirley, the medical director of infection prevention for UW Health, says while there's no data yet on whether there will be a dramatic difference in protection between additional boosts of the current vaccines and new Omicron specific shots, there is data showing current vaccines work to prevent severe illness and death. So don't wait for the new version to get boosted, especially as cases rise. If you're eligible for a shot, uh, now is the time to protect yourself. As for the science to get COVID under control, Dr. Shirley says trust the process and stay the course. It feels like right now that we're going to have endless boosters every three months or something like that. Like that's not the long term goal. We're kind of trying to catch up and get over these humps, but we're still in the thick of it right now is the problem that we keep getting these uh, surges. And because of this surge in the BA5 variant, Dr. Shirley and Milwaukee County's chief health advisor, Dr. Ben Weston, both recommend bring that mask back out. Start wearing it in indoor public spaces when you're close to others. Reporting in Shorewood, Katie Crowther, TMJ4 News.